the juice, I got the juice Ten old Chatham's on, Foolies glad I'm on Even my haters kinda glad I'm on, rest in peace to my back Hey, what's happening guys? Best NHL clips here and today we are back with episode number two of Consequences. And before we get started, I just want to say thank you for all the support we got on episode number one. You guys absolutely love the idea and it makes me so happy. I asked for 100 likes, you guys gave me over 150 likes for a new series. That's insane boys, keep it up. You know what, this time I'm going to do you a solid. I'm only going to ask for four likes. One, two, three, four. So if you guys could give me four likes on episode number two, that would be great. And also, thank you for the consequences. You can see them on screen right now. I have gotten some great ideas from you guys, so keep them coming. Keep throwing in consequences. Keep throwing in rewards. And I also got pitched one good idea from somebody in the comments. You can see the comment right here. And basically, he was saying, what if you were to, you know, make it a little bit scary, a little bit stressful on yourself by pulling out one consequence before the game and one reward. So you go into that game not knowing whether or not you're gonna win or lose, and if you win, you get the reward, but if you lose, you get the consequence. So it's kind of like what we were doing before, just instead of putting it at the end of the game, you put it at the beginning of the game. That way, it's more nerve wracking for you while you're playing. You know the consequence, you're sitting there just like, holy crap, am I gonna have to do this? or? Can I get the reward? Like, which one will it be? So we're going to try that out this episode. And for you guys, all I would like you to do this episode is by the end of this episode, determine which way you like more. So if you like it with the consequence and reward, not knowing what it is and waiting till the end after you win or lose, or if you like it before and watching me stress out about it, comment down below which one you'd like me to use more. And that's the one we'll go with for this series. It was a great idea and it adds a little bit of change change to this series all right boys so here we go time to find out what we're going to be stressing about so first off the consequence all right i think i got oh i got three here okay let's see take that one off take this one off and we'll grab the middle one so what will our consequence be it will be use 94 controls for a game that would be shitty. That would be so shitty. So that one's out. And whichever one we don't end up using goes back into the bin, okay? So if we don't get the reward, it goes back in. So here we go. And now for the reward. There we go. We got two again here. They're kind of sticking together on me. But here it is, boys. Here it is. Give your first line center a plus five all. There we go, boys. So that's what's on the line for this episode, and let's get into the game. All right, boys, so here we go. So as many of you know, we had to quick sell Murray, which means Des Prez is in the lineup. He's one of the players we pulled in a pack in one of our opening packs there. So might as well fill that position. And by the end of this game, we're either gonna be doing one of two things, picking up a, for real, for real. Oh my God. Talk about an ugly stir. How can we get any more unlucky? At this rate, we're going to be facing the consequence. So anyways, boys, as I was saying, by the end of this game, we're either going to be facing our consequence and playing on 94 controls next game, or if we can make the comeback now, we are going to be giving our center a plus five all. So hopefully it's the reward. Wow. Oh my goodness. That was some shitty defense. Shitty defense on my end. But for real, man, he's just scoring at will. You're kidding me. What a fucking lucky poke. And of course he scores because Anderson can't stop a beach ball. What is this? Come on, boys. What the fuck? It's 3 nothing already. Wow. Wow, that's so bad. I am so bad. God, oh, I'm just, I'm thinking already we're going to face this consequence. Oh, and a beautiful shot. Absolutely beautiful shot, just to top it off. Oh my God, how do I miss that? And Anderson made a save. Oh, that's almost unbelievable. 
that is that is insane. I didn't think I'd see the day. And another one. Wow. Wow. Oh my god. Oh no! How did we not score? That was one of the nicest breakouts and plays I have done in this game. Huge moves, and then Anderson, you can't stop a beach ball, man. What the hell is going on? Oh no, we should have had a goal there. Oh my god, Anderson. What is happening? What is actually happening? I can't wait to see the stats at the end of this period. Yes, finally we got one. We finally got one. But it looks like next episode, we're going to be trying to resist having to face another consequence while playing on 94 controls. My god. Why was Desprez getting up like that? He just stepped up for no reason. And by the time I took control of him, his player was already past me. What the hell, man? What are my AI doing? What is my goalie doing? What is happening right now? I haven't lost this bad all year. There it is. Thank you. Another goal. Finally. Huh. Oh my god, fuck off, oh, I'm sick of this, I'm so sick of this, come on man, Anderson, what an awful game, and now we have to play with 94 controls next episode, oh that's so brutal, that's so brutal, and I mean I outplayed the guy, I fucking outplayed the guy. Oh no! Alright boys, so if you enjoyed this, once again, if we could get 4 likes, I'd love it. I love you guys so much. Thank you for all the support on this series. Don't forget to comment down below whether you like it this way more, or the initial way where we choose it at the end. So anyways boys, until then, hope you enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you next time. Have a great day, you sexy studs.